Guinean students in China continue to pile pressure on governments to evacuate them. To talk to us on this, uh, we've been joined by uh, the ranking member of parliament on the health committee, uh, Mr. Minta Akanda, over the phone. Good afternoon, sir. What do you make of a call by students in China to be evacuated back home? Okay, thank you very much. Um, I think that the government attitude towards the combat of this disease, uh, for me, it's, 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 it's not appropriate. And uh, uh, about three days ago, the minister responsible for um, health appeared on the floor of the house, and he himself even indicated that when he had interactions with the Chinese ambassador to China, they recommended to them that they should ever quit Chinese students, especially in Wuhan, to Ghana. Unfortunately, um, they've not told us tests in place and protocols in place to screen all these students and bring them back to Ghana. And it's not only even the evacuation, the whole preparation towards the combat of the disease, for me, uh, is not satisfactory. You recall about three days ago that um, they, they had a, sus a suspected case in Kolebu, and all the health professionals there were running health as skelter because we have not prepared. Right. But the irony of the whole issue is that, you remember, we came from Ebola not too long ago. So we had all these structures in place. We had isolation centers, one at Tamale, one at uh, Tema, and all those things. And even at the point in time, Ghana was chosen as the distribution hub for the uh, logistics to combat Ebola. So we even had the opportunity to train some health professionals in all these uh, fields. Unfortunately, instead of us to, instead of us to reactivate the whole thing, we seem to be reinventing the wheel. And I mean, I don't even believe whether there is anything like 2.5 million uh, Ghana cities to take care of this particular disease. Because I have heard, and when the Deputy Minister for Foreign Affairs appeared on the floor of the House, he also reiterated that we have given students in Wuhan, and in the whole world, that is the hardest hit area. And Ghanaian students, they have only been given 5,000 Ghana cities. And as I speak to you, some of them, I'm talking to some of them, they are indoor. Even how to get food to eat is a problem. Exactly. You understand? Yes. Yeah. Now, so it, it means that clearly, clearly we are ill-prepared, um, you know, to contain them if they are brought back home. But they have concerns. They, they say, for instance, that other students from other parts of Africa have been taken back home. They cite exactly. seashells and Mauritania. So what, what do we do for, 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 for Ghanaian students in China then? Do we keep them and hopefully send them more money? What we have to do is that psychologically they are even not fine in China. So first and foremost, what we have to do is that we must have protocol in place to evacuate them once they get to Ghana. We have a way of screening them, a, a way of identification, a way of diagnosis, a way of proper transportation if we suspect any case, a way of quarantining any case, and then a way of management if there is any, before we even allow them into the system. And as I speak to you now, don't forget that there are a lot of Chinese in this country already, and there are a lot of Chinese outside there. So as I speak to you, in my humble opinion, they should even call all Chinese in the various regions to the various regional hospitals and screen them. Uh, see, if you go to, at least, if you go to every regional hospital, we must have a segregated area to deal with this corona issue, coronavirus issue. You know, without necessarily interfering with the uh, normal operations of the hospital. But what do you see? Nothing. Even communication. Communication. Remember what happened during the Ebola era? We must have a well-coordinated communication with the masses. My grandfather or mother or my brother in the village must know about the virus. Have you ever heard a general in uh, TV3 or anywhere talking about coronavirus, apart from the journalists coming out in their own way to talk about this virus? But government must engage the people. The political will is not there. As right. In the, in the era of, the, of, of Ebola. And right. we need the highest political mm. about disease. It's about the health sector. I have not even heard the president speak about this particular issue. Thank you so much, Mr. Minta Kando. He is the ranking member of parliament uh, on the health committee.